So, for my Thursday night smoke this week, I've come slightly further afield than normal. I've come up north to see the wife's family. So, finally made it up north. This is Watergate Street in Chester, I believe. Uh, that's how I say it anyway. And uh, here you go, here's the cigar shop. Been looking forward to coming here for a couple of weeks. This cigar shop is pretty much close to the center. I would say it's got a good selection of Cubans, regionals, limited editions, as well as a nice mix of gift ideas. Also a good selection of whiskies, along with New World cigars, which I actually picked up a couple whilst I was here, as it is something I'm determined I'm going to do a bit more of. Anyway, time for the smoke, where I let somebody else cut and light my cigar for a change. It's a nice experience. If you've not seen somebody do this, it's actually quite a nice art form to watch. You do need patience. Mm. Whiskey's on the left, though, don't Yeah. Nice. So, punch double corona from 99, and I've let somebody else cut and light my cigar. That's the first for at least 10 years, if not longer. I have some friends who will be um, shocked and amazed, almost as bad as me drinking lager the other night. I'll let you know how it goes. I just have a space. Huh? That's it, I like the decor. And then it was on to the live. Hello everybody who's joining. So as promised, I'm actually doing a Thursday afternoon smoke and I'm actually doing it live for a change. I'm having a punch double corona from 1999. So 23 year old smoke. Very, very nice. Very, very mellow cigar, which is unlike Punch, because Punch is normally quite a harsh sort of finish. But this is just all floral flavours. There's no spice in it at all. So as I'm actually live for once, are there any questions people want to ask that I normally answer in comments? Oh, by the way, what I think about it, this is one of my dogs. This is Ref, one of my Dachshunds. He's come to the lounge with me. So there's room for four people here. There's the little bar they got over there. Brian, who's with me today, he's waiting for his next shot of whiskey. <laughs> and he's got the other dog. I did try a pipe for a while. Couldn't get on with it. I had something called Pipe Bite. Jameson's that barrel. I haven't tried that one. Jameson that I have tried and I really did like was um, 2006 Special Reserve. Actually, thanks. My day's going really well. Very well, actually. This is a really nice cigar and a good way to unwind. The, uh, the wife and my sister-in-law have both gone off shopping, so they've left us. How do they word it? The man crash. To be honest, I have to admit, I'm surprised at how many of you have joined. It's nice to see so many people did. Yes, I have visited Wales in Somerset, actually. It's quite nice, because obviously, we, as we know, Hot Fuzz was shot there. So it's actually quite nice to sit out on the, the high street, enjoy a cigar, whilst um, you can picture growing this where things were shot, which is actually a good laugh. Sorry to leave you so early, but as the wife has returned, I'm going to disappear and go and do some adult stuff now. But I will probably be back on later on tonight. So I shall catch you guys later. <laughs>